Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. I've tried to make onto meal stew, so I'm going to go to the market to buy some ingredients. I have some of them already, but most of them I'm going to buy today at the market and then maybe buy a couple other things. So yeah, join me. This is my journey to make onto meal stew. Oh, and let me add, this is my, my chauffeur for the day. It's my sister. She'll be helping me because, you know, I need, I need an assistant. So thank you. Let's go, let's go to the market. The Beast Doctor. Alright, so boom, back in the kitchen, straight to work. These are the consumer leaves, slicing them up into thin, you know, thin slices. Always remember to wash your leaves before you cook them because if you don't, you might die. Your throat will itch you for the rest of your life and you don't want that, trust me. So yeah, this is what it looks like, all sliced up. Then we move on to the palm oil, right? So we add some palm oil to the pan and I like to add some diced onions just to, you know, just to get the flavor into the oil. And then we add even more onions because what's West African food without some onions and some tomatoes? So here we go, more onions. This has been blended with like ginger, garlic, peppers, you know, all the good stuff is in there. So you mix it up and then I like to add carrots to the food because it gives like a little hint of sweetness, not too much, but you know, it makes it good. You know, you leave down the fire for like, 10 to 15 minutes, you know, medium high heat. And then we move on to the blended tomatoes. So you pour that in, mix it up again, get it in all the corners, you know, combine it nicely, leave that on the fire again for like 15 minutes. So while that's on the fire, we need to pick up our seeds, our melon seeds, or I call it, I've always known it as agushi. Some people call it agushi. It really depends on what part of West Africa you're from. I blend that a little with a little bit of water, not too much. You just want to paste so you put that in the stew different sections you know spread it out nicely so they don't combine too much leave down the fire again this one on lower heat maybe like medium low to medium heat I come back in 15 minutes and then they kind of like solidify you know so you need to break it up and mix it into the stew look at that it gives it some lovely textures you know the stew is popping with the, you know the carrots and the the agushi and oh man so here, let's go to the spices. What we've got here, we've got salt. We've got salt here, we've got black pepper. We've got allspice. We've got mixed spices. So you need to add all these spices in there. You know, you need to get all the flavors going. The flavors in here are crazy. You know, of course you have to combine them. Let it get into all the corners and now the most important part, the leaves, the contemporary leaves. So what I like to do is, like I said, if you don't wash your leaves properly, your throat will itch. But at the same time, if you don't cook them properly as well, your throat will itch. So what I like to do is, I like to steam the leaves on the side before I add them to the main thing. So that's what I've done here. I steam them a little bit, kind of like halfway on the side and then bring it here to cook for the rest of the way. If you don't do it enough, if you don't cook it enough, if you don't wash it, properly yeah you know you're not going to enjoy the food and as you know we need something a little chewy so i've got some oyster mushrooms wash them spice them and yeah let's throw them in wow oh my god combine once again everything needs to go everywhere all the corners of corners of the thing added a little water because it's getting kind of dry yeah voila you know you leave it to cook for about 15 minutes I've said a lot of 15 minutes cooking time, so it takes a while to cook. It takes a while to cook West African food. You need to cook it with love. You can't rush. Boil up some plantains to eat with this and yeah, 
decent meals, decent West African meals, very tasty, very healthy, very vegan.